What's up you guys, it's your best friend Sage25. I'm still pretty sick, but uh, I'm going to attempt to do a commentary here. Uh, we're playing some team deathmatch on Outpost, and I'm using the MSR. Uh, I'm not actually watching the game here, because I'm not going to talk about it. Um, but I do get a pretty sweet kill feed here at the beginning. I miss a shot, but uh, still get the kill feed. What are you going to do? Um, anyway, I just want to talk about a few things <coughs> Excuse me, that have to do with my channel. So, um, what I'm thinking is after my surgery, uh, when I start posting videos again and doing commentaries, I'm going to start uh, talking about more relevant things, talking about things going on in the world or just things uh, about my life or stories about myself or whatever um, that hopefully you guys will find more interesting than uh, just rambling on about uh, Call of Duty. Because uh, Call of Duty is cool and interesting, um, but you guys get to see the gameplay, so you don't really need to hear me talk about it. Uh, I think that's what separates a lot of uh, a big YouTube guys from the channels that can't really grow. Is that, <clears throat> I mean, the ones with big channels are really entertaining, and most of them are really good at the game, and uh, they can give good tips. But uh, a lot of them also you know open themselves up to their subs and uh... and uh... i don't know they're just really open about uh... their lives and stuff like that anyway not that i i have uh... very interesting stuff to talk about but whatever um, another thing is uh... i want your guys opinions because i want to start doing some series uh... so i can get some sort of consistent videos up that i know i want to post all the time uh, so one idea that I want to do is a sniper series um, covering, because I like all the sniper rifles in this game. So basically just going through each one uh, in uh, their own individual um, video and giving you the pros and cons, uh, just showing you a gameplay, either a gameplay or just uh, some clips that I get with this, with each particular sniper rifle. Uh, tell you which ones I like the best um, and then to go with that if you guys enjoy that then I would move on to uh, the assault rifles I could do the assault rifles the SMGs I mean I could go through all the guns if you wanted I, I don't know if I would want to suffer through uh, trying to get gameplays with like the LMGs and the shotguns and stuff because uh, that's just not me but uh, but we'll see anyway that's one idea um, another one is uh, a series I know someone I don't know who it is, White Boy or somebody, does uh, Moab Mondays. Uh, that's cool. I was thinking about doing Moab Madness or something like that. Um, just a series uh, of Moabs. I'm going to post Moab videos anyway, but uh, I would just title it Moab Madness or whatever. Or if you guys have a better name for it, then uh, let me know. Um, that's another idea. Um, another is how to play free for all. Uh, because I'm getting pretty good at free-for-all and I can show you guys uh, pretty good spots on each map uh, to hold down to do the best and uh, also what what the best setups are to run um, so let me know if you would enjoy that another one that I just thought about last night because uh, I was playing in a party and I most of the time at least at night uh, I play with a party of four or five maybe six people and uh, we do pretty well whether we go into mosh pit or domination or kill confirmed or team defender uh, we all have a pretty good grasp on the game so um, and we've played together for so long that we know what we're gonna do pretty much um, I play too much by myself that my win ratio right now is like 2.5 or 2.4 but uh, I have a couple friends who have uh, like five or six win ratios and one that's like eight or nine uh, because we uh, we play together a lot and we work as a team uh, so that's one thing I was thinking of talking about and doing a series on is uh, showing you guys setups showing you guys uh, choke points and positions uh, because maybe you do play with a team or you do play with a party and uh, I know a, a lot of teams that do this, they play in parties with their friends or whatever, but uh, they don't talk, really. They don't talk in the game at all. And uh, that's 
one thing that's a huge deal um, that I've been doing ever since uh, I, I've been playing with friends, you know, we take it seriously and we uh, have callouts. Uh, one thing is making up callouts on each map, and I could go through some of those maybe. Um, but yeah, I, I have some videos where we're just set up in domination or something, or team defender, uh, and we have a grasp on the spawn points, and we just uh, destroy the other team. And uh, it's really the game's a lot more fun when you do that, and uh, it's not fun for the other team, honestly, because a lot of the times the team is going to be full of randoms, and you're not playing against a full party. Um, but honestly, uh, <laughs> that's not uh, my concern. Uh, I don't care uh, how mad someone else gets at playing the game, you know, that's not my issue. I've gotten mad plenty of times, uh, but uh, it's a learning experience for them, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Anyway, uh, I'm going to wrap this up. Um, let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you like those ideas. Also, if you have any other ideas for some uh, series or videos or uh, anything that you guys want from me. Just tell me. Also, uh, double click like, leave a comment, uh, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. It's a big deal. I love it. And uh, I will see you guys in the near future with another video. Later, y'all. Peace.